constant side cannulation using blunt needles has been advocated as a means to overcome the damaging effects of sharp needle cannulation experienced in rope ladder and area puncture cannulation. Until now, buttonhole cannulation technique was the only way to create a constant sight. However, recent studies highlight the difficulties associated with implementing buttonhole techniques successfully and clearly identify the weaknesses and risks of this freehand technique. Buttonhole technique has many limitations. It is unguided, relies heavily on the cannulator's skill set and the patient's anatomy, and is affected by shifting arm and fistula positions from one dialysis session to the next. Because there are no means to ensure a single cannulation path, use of freehand buttonhole technique may result in multiple vessel puncture sites and aneurysm. Additionally, increased trauma to the skin due to excessive use of sharp needles leads to an increased risk of infection. V-wing guided cannulation technique is a revolution in constant site cannulation, providing a safe, consistent, and predictable path to the fistula. The V-wing is a subcutaneous and extravascular needle guide that acts as a target and guide to assist cannulation. Dr. William Jennings and others reported impressive safety and efficacy results in the Journal of Vascular Surgery, including 96% success in accessing previously uncannulatable fistulas, 100% secondary functional patency, absence of aneurysm, and low infection. An 18-month follow-up of the V-Wing's post-study use at 34 dialysis clinics demonstrated impressive long-term results. V-wing guided cannulation technique is different from buttonhole technique in several very important ways. The palpation ridge indicates the fistula location and optimal skin insertion point. The funnel shape guides the needle to a consistent vessel entry point, reducing vessel and tissue trauma. Encapsulation and granulation tissue facilitate formation of a consistent tissue path from skin to vessel. The encapsulated V-wing and granulation tissue also provide separation between skin and vessel entry points, a potential infection barrier that creates distance between the blood vessel and bacteria commonly found on the skin surface. V-wing guided cannulation technique standardizes the cannulation path, helping to enable desired benefits of blunt needle cannulation, overcome anatomical and staphing limitations, and potentially reduce catheter time associated with fistula maturation and dialysis interruption. The V-wing benefits are apparent for fistulas that are deep and difficult to cannulate, but because the V-wing can be placed without moving the fistula from its native position, these benefits can also be extended to patients whose cannulation challenges are not severe enough to justify more invasive surgical revisions. The skilled staff and dialysis nurses at Vital Access are ready to support dialysis clinics with training materials that have been approved by major dialysis providers. Representatives will be present in person to assist with first cannulations and are available for ongoing support. Contact Vital Access for more information about how V-Wing can overcome problems associated with current practices and help your patients experience safe, consistent, and predictable access to their AV fistula.